Hey, how are you? You want a removal? Yeah, he's right there. Yeah, he's right there. It's a big one. You want to see him? Oh! My goodness. Look at that shot placement. Listen, we, we love them as much as you do but we cannot allow these iguanas to overpopulate yeah. South Florida. Oh, it ran, yo. He's gone? Yeah. Where'd he go? Inside those bushes. Oh, yeah, I see one. Headshot, headshot. Go ahead, take it. Ripping at? Oh. Good shot. Nice. Here, boy. Another one in the back. Oh, oh yeah, that's goodness. him. That's, yeah, that's him. Hey, sir. Hey. Hey, sir. You want a removal? Yeah, I know. How are you doing today? I saw you. Fine, and you? Good, good. Doing well. Good. Slaying some dragons. Excellent. Thank you. <laughs> Take as many as possible. Oh yeah, we are trying, my Absolutely, friend. sir. Yes, sir. I um, have pellets and pellets by myself. Oh, really? So, yeah. Yeah? I've been taking a few out. It's true. Can I actually, it's what kind of uh, air gun? Or? It's just a BB gun. Oh, just a BB? Oh, okay. Yeah, and put a few pellets in it. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. And I have a little terrier that loves to chase and catch them too. So nice. Oh, <laughs> yeah. that's awesome. But they're horrible. Yeah. Absolutely horrible. They destroy everything. Yes, sir. Especially plant life. I mean, they just clean it. Yep. Anything that has flowers on it, they disappear. Exactly. Yeah, it's crazy. They love it. And that's why we're here. Excellent. You all, every time you come in, you be sure to stop right here. <laughs> you got you. <laughs> You have, a, you have a wonderful day. You too. Thanks, guys. You're welcome. Awesome. Good shooting, guys. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, that was definitely him. He looks so much bigger. Yeah, he does. Didn't he? Didn't he? he look, so, you know what's crazy? Gosh. He did look bigger. That was, he, was, he, was he, he looked double. Okay, I, I know that's him, but it's crazy because he literally looked double the size when we pulled up. He looked double the size. You know, Ninja, why do you think he looked bigger, bro? Oh, he was trying to attract the females. He, you know, as numerous as he could have been stuffed on how many, uh, much grass he's been eating. Uh, You're saying he kind of like puffed himself up and yeah, kind of... Yeah, just puffed made... him up just to make himself look big because he knows he's, he's, he's around here on the self, on the ground so we'll, give you, we'll give you an example real quick. Look, that's me like kind of like trying to like compress myself. Yeah. This is me trying to make myself look bigger. Oh. Oh, come no here, soft. females. I'm good. No come here, females. Oh. You want to? Hold on. You in my turf, bro? Uh, no, you in my no turf, problems, bro? bro. I'm going to bump my head. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you see, that's kind of a little example right there of what these iguanas are doing. Good job, Ninja. Good eye. We're here already. Let's let's just peek around this bend real quick, right? Yeah, tell me twice. I've already got blood on my hands. I'm ready to go. <laughs> I thought it was a branch. Yeah, yeah. Just like this? Yeah. Then look right here. And that's the end of that. Shooter. What? Do that, dude. I thought. This is my 
I don't come out here to play. I mean, I'm no, I get that, but I, like, like seriously, dude. Like, <laughs> that doesn't even make sense, dog. Like, what you're looking at? Would you see it, right? Yes. Yeah, it. <laughs> it's crazy, dude. You got some Superman eyes. Oh, yes! Oh. There she is. She's stunned? Nice, dude. I don't know how I saw that, guys. Don't ask me. She blends have in, too. What? And she super blends in. Guys, don't ask me how. I just have the eye of the Iguana Ninja. Hey, look at his look at his femoral pores. They're swollen. Look at that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look at that. Look at his femoral pores, dude. Oh. <laughs> look at that right there. See how they're like they're like yeah, they are swollen. Yeah. Whoa. This boy trying to Rub lay his scent, scent down. Yeah. Whoa. Well, he thought he had a whole tree for himself or the pre-breeding season like i said not with the ninja on board yeah i'll give it to ninja on that one y'all i mean how like the smidget of just the head poking on the tree it looks like it could have just been like a, a, another yeah, piece of broken branch or debris in the tree and he he immediately knew it was in the going ahead how that's only an answer that he can answer uh, i honestly can't even answer it's just the will and the thrive that i have for what i do i don't like what i do people i love it so when I get a chance to come out here, best believe any and any iguana that I and I sees is getting put in the bag. Like, comment, subscribe. It's the iguana ninja eyes. Let's go, baby. Let me know when you're ready. Mm. <laughs> Whoa! Oh! Dang! Whoa! Oh, I was just about to shoot you. Good shot. Good shot. That was a great shot. That stopper right there, ladies and gentlemen. That is called the non escape bullet right there. So before they go in, hold up. Before I, let me just put him out of his misery before I continue to talk. It's all right. Anyway. Uh, yeah, that was a stopping bullet right there. It's right before the iguanas is, is like right there about to escape. Look at our prize. Ooh, 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 what is that? This is a Sheila. Really? This is a leopard too. Nice. Leopard Gosh. and orange and green. Guys, look at this. Let's go 360 real quick. Oh my goodness. This is a beautiful Sheila. Now, when they're like this, they look like a young alpha male. That's what I thought it was. Just another uh, alpha male. But once you guys turn her around, look at those those pores. You see they're not really there. Yep. That's how you tell. It's a Sheila. Mm -hmm. Usually the males would have the big pores sticking out. Yep. Also, like I seen her, her she was out, but her dewlap, it was like kind of droopy. It wasn't like big and extended nope. as big males. It was kind of like, just like limp, kind of like droopy. Like, it's like she was sending out a beacon, come to me. Exactly. And right when we popped out, she was like, like Ninja said, she was right at the edge of the escape, you know, where, where she, the shot is lost. I just had to do what I had to do. Where did I hit her at though, Ninja? must have been like right here 
Yeah, that's on the other side. Actually. Yep. Oh, nice. That's probably the exit. Probably hit it right there or something. Nice, nice. Yep, right there. Hey, gorgeous colors on that, though. Here, let's, let's get a close-up of that. Yeah, let's get it. Let's show you guys real quick the colors and the pattern of that iguana right there. Look at that right there. Guys, there's not a lot of animals that have that type of pattern in nature with those type of colors on it. We're talking about orange, green, a little bit of blue, a little bit of emerald in there. And then to just to, to, to top it all off with a leopard pattern. Look at that right there. Look. Look at her back. We call these down here leopard iguanas. Yeah, look at that right there. It's insane. Just like a leopard. It's mm. insane. Another one in the back. In the back. Oh, yeah. Yeah, buddy. Oh, look at that. Is that. Oh, my goodness. I call those Seahawks, but they're not. They're like uh, egrets, I think. Leave a comment down below if you know what uh, bird of prey that is. All right, let's 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 peek around here real quick. Oh, one right there sleeping. Good off. Three, two, one. Woo! Woo! Tagged him. I ain't gonna lie, that first shot, he didn't need my backup. <laughs> no, 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 but I saw what both of them did. Dude, that was disgusting. Yeah, that one was sleeping. There was one walking past there. Any, uh, uh, any guess on what they could have probably been doing then? Um, well, my first thought is she probably got bread and now she's tired. She's trying to conserve her energy. That could be one thing. Or she is, she's trying to get as much sun as possible. So what she was trying to do is blend in with the grass and soak up sun at the same time. Oh yeah, I think that's exactly what she was trying yeah, to do. Yeah, that second one sounds a little bit better. I think both of them could be accurate, Ninja. Is it me or does she, does she seem to be on the porky side? Ooh. Let's find out. Wow. Mm, they're probably developing now. Oh. Can't really tell but the the ones that i that i saw the other day you could actually see the curves in them you know when you see the curves and the eggs are like poking out yep that's you can see the curves like right here on each rib you can see them. really yeah so but it's hey we're getting there we're actually we're actually in the season yeah we're we are it, it, we are in the season so maybe so, some have started early yes yeah, so maybe some anything later. is exactly but you see how she was laying down flat like flat. that dude Just, I, I didn't see it you want a man poke poke uh, she was laying down like a, like a baby alligator. Yeah. Ninja, let's keep going down this trail because look, down there the sun is not beating. Yeah. So it's probably super cool. Yeah, it's probably not gonna be good over there. But down here we've already seen one. We we shot another one, so yep. we've seen two. So I think that's a good indication to keep going forward. What do you say? Yes, sir. All right. Throw her in the shade real quick. Yep. Throw her in the shade. Her right there. Wow. Talk about a chunky monkey. Look at look how, look at the thickness of that tail right there. Yeah, that is a that's some good eating there, boys and oh, girls. Yeah. Oh yeah, crazy, crazy. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yes, the semi-auto. Oh my goodness. Water. Yeah, I didn't want to give him the opportunity. Oh hey, how are you? Iguana removal. Yeah, he's right there. Yeah, he's right there. It's a big one. You want to see him? You want to see him? Come look, it's big. Oh, good gosh. That's <laughs> semi-auto marauder. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. The other shots were a little bit to the left, so right away I was able to keep my eye on the target and give him that final blow right there that just put him out. That shot was a distracted shot. No, a ninja got him good and got him like perplexed and paralyzed and confused for a little bit. Oh! oh. that shot placement the marauder semi auto baby <laughs> Woo! Wow. He, still, he still got some juice in him let's hold those back legs yep
Better safe than sorry, Nick. Yep. Oh my goodness, look at that shot placement. Oh, wow. Semi auto. I don't even know. Oh, that's where I hit him. You get him right, right there. there. Oh, you got him with a good long shot. That would explain why he flipped yeah. over and he was like, whoa. Oh my goodness. And then the finishing blow right there with the with the, the next shot right there. Wow. He's big, huh? Yeah. Yes, ma'am, I do. But they're super invasive down here. Yeah. Yes, that's what all those people told me. Yeah. They are invasive. I know. They're they're. Listen, we we love them as much as you do, but we cannot allow these iguanas to overpopulate yeah. South Florida. Yeah. There's there is possibly is probably more than ten thousand iguanas here. Yeah. There's more iguanas than there are native animals out here, so that's why we're trying to control them. They're there's a lot more. Just because we got that one, there's a lot of them hiding. We're just able to only get the ones we're able to see. This is a big one right here. Right now, they're tr they're gonna try to breed, breed with mate, and, and have babies. One one girl has 60 eggs. 60, six zero. So you know, I know you feel bad, but you know it's something that needs to be done. Unfortunately, you know. But if it makes you feel any better, and it might not, or it might make you feel better, but a lot of these big ones. We actually, people actually eat them. We eat them. Yeah. Yeah. You? Yeah. Yep. I eat them too. Yes, yeah. ma'am. So it's so in, so it tastes honestly. It tastes. If you ever had frog legs or gator, it's around that same end. Those two things. Yes, ma'am. It tastes really good. You could you could curry it. You could uh, deep fry it. You could bake it. You could do whatever to it. You just got to cook it properly, and it'll come out amazing. They, I'm telling you. They they call them the chicken of the trees. Yep. Yeah, or bamboo chickens. And you got to think about it. They're one of the cleanest meats out there because all they eat all day is grass, plants, and flowers, and fruit. So it's some of the very cleanest meat. Unfortunately, we see them out here, and there is an order to take them all out. But fortunately, I mean, he's not going to go to waste. We will eat him. You know, we don't like to just, just waste them. Oh, he's dead. No, he's dead. So after after they die, their nerves and their tail and their, and their whole body. See, he's he's not alive. He's not alive. Not I alive. promise you, he's not alive. It's all nervous. It's a it's a uh, uh, defensive mechanism. We'll give him one more, but he's definitely not alive. He's not alive. All right. Well, he's not alive now. Thank you. And we're sorry about that. But if you have any more questions, go on Google. And look up uh, in, uh, iguanas in Florida, FWC. Okay. Do you watch YouTube? Do you watch YouTube or no? Okay, we have YouTube channels. Iguana Man on YouTube. Iguana Ninja. Iguana Ninja. If you look up Iguana Man, Iguana Ninja, you'll see some of our videos. And you'll kind of see what we do. But we got this guy. It's only a matter of a couple days or weeks before another one takes his place. There's that many of them. That a smaller one will take his place or even a bigger one and he'll try to breed with all the females in this area this is an alpha this is a big one right here how old do you think he is ninja i would honestly i would say probably like four or five years old yeah. so they grow every every time they shed they, every time they shed they grow another foot so yeah they can they, i think they can live up to like 20 There's, there, long time. there's a lot of them out here, so like I said, we're trying to control as many of them as we can. Whatever opportunities we have to control them, that's what we're going to do, but it's easier said than done. Just as we got this guy, there's probably 20 of them right here that we don't see. Hiding. In here. So. <laughs> you see any? Let's see if we see any real quick. A lot of people who don't know, but iguanas, they actually live in holes underneath the ground. Oh, yes. Did you know that? No. So that's another issue that people are having is they make holes around here. Uh, near the sea? Yep. Near the, yep. Water. near the water. They'll make holes and then that's where they go in when it gets cold or when they go to lay their eggs. But what they're saying over time is that, that, that type of digging 
might be bad for the legs. So, just because we don't see them here, it's a little cold. They are, they're definitely here. So, we're hiding wherever their nest is at or wherever, you know, they're at in the trees. But what's your name? We're your Iguana Removal Pest Control Service out here, okay? Oh, okay. So it's nice to meet you. Um, I wish I had a business card to give it to you. I think I might, but if you had any other questions... Here you go. If you have any other questions, or if you have iguanas in, in your house, because another thing too is they're, they're going on top of the roofs and they're going inside the, like, in the tiles and in the ceilings too. Yeah, so if you have any questions, right? We come out here, no charge to you, okay? okay. Alright? You're welcome. You have a wonderful day, okay? Bon appetit, please. Yes. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Thank you. Wee wee. Wee wee. Shoo. Go ahead and throw that Sheila in the bag. Woo! Oh, the bag is looking thick, y'all. Look at that. Store-bought gravy. Wow. We're hunting the last bask of the day right now. As you can see, the sun is beaming. In a couple of minutes, though, it's going to slowly deteriorate, and the temperature is going to drastically change, and these iguanas are not going to be out. Ninja, let's go ahead. Let's go for one more round. Let's do it. Let's see. We have a couple hot spots that we have to check out. We, we, we just have a theory, and we think that they might be concentrated in this area because the sun is going to be beaming there right now. Let's head over there, and we'll see you all out there. Let's do this. When I get to the house, bro, we're gonna we're gonna open up some of these females and see what the deal is. We gotta see what the progress is. I feel like something light, but like you can feel the, the intestines are the small intestines are right here. But on the side, you can feel like just little like balls or something. Interesting. Oh wow! Yeah, that's weird. It's 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 a potential. Anything is possible, guys. Anything is possible. Want a man and you want a ninja on the board. Woo! Hey, that's gonna wrap it up today. Ninja, not a bad day for uh, all for a slow day. Yeah. For a late, a late, a late evening. kind of chilly. Yeah, a, a, a fall day. This is actually yeah. our first fall evening hunt during the day, dude. And we I think we killed it, bro. Oh yeah. I think we killed it. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. Hold on. Let me put Hold on now. Hold on now. Hold on now. Look at this slab Whoa! of meat. Okay. Barbecue. God bless you. God bless you, Manny. Thanks, All right. Man, um, we'll do a quick countdown real quick, Ninja. I'll give you the honors. Go ahead, my friend. All right. Bada boom, bada bing. We got a one, a two, a three, four, five, and six. Mm, six piece right there. Yep. Now. So we got two females yep. and... Young male. Yep, young male. Another female. Wait, a female? Yeah, this is a female. Female? Okay, three females, three, three males. males. Ooh. Wow. That's interesting. Um, I just want to show you guys something real quick. Let me just show you the different stages of males. This would be the, the stage that kind of what you're going to be seeing a lot of right quick. Just green, dark, green belly. But then this is the second phase right here. This is what he evolved. This one will evolve into is the same size the same kind of thing but if, as you as you notice the coloration is different look at this the scales are not only green anymore but they are red and orange the spikes have grown quite considerably and they're also orange dewlap is orange face is more white and that is the that is the the second stage ninja what is the third and final stage after that alpha Alpha stage. <laughs> it's the alpha stage. That was actually perfect. 
that is really like the perfect definition of how these iguanas yep. evolved every time. Absolutely. So now that we've talked about the males, let's get to the females. Like Iguana Man said, this isn't like the first first stage, but this is technically the first stage, guys. Yep. Look at that. This is very small. And mind you, this one could also lay eggs. Really? Yes. I believe it's what? When they turn, what, three? When they turn, like, what, three uh, months? Actually, it's eight, a year and a half, 18 a months. A that's, half, the, 18 that's the months. theory. That's the theory. That's the theory. So when they turn 18 months, they can start to develop eggs, and they're fully mature, yep. and they could lay eggs and do all that stuff. Yep. So that's the first stage. You can see this one is orange, little orange, but yep. dark. But then the second stage, look at, look at that, Sheila. Wow. I would say, so I would say this one is probably like two years old. Mm -hmm. This one probably just hit three years old. Yeah. And I'm going to flip her over. And then this big Sheila, I would say she's about like four or five. Wow. Just look at that. Look, look at the, look at the, they're almost the same size. But yep. That's why I said this one was three and this is probably four going on five. But let me show you something just to, to speak on that. All right. Uh, another another uh, indication on how to tell if the female is alpha or not is if you look by her neck right here. If you look by that neck, look how much fatter. Oh, yeah. Look how much thicker that neck is right there, that neck meat, compared to this female's neck. Oh, there's, there's, wow. There's hardly any armor. There's hardly no thickness. But right here, look at that. Yeah, she has a lot of armor. Super thick because when the males are out trying to breed with her, right. they will go on top of her and bite the neck to show oh, dominance, wow. to show dominance. They do that to fight off males and they do that to court with females to show who's the alpha and that way he can go ahead and breed. So they need that thick padded. But that's that's another way to tell that she's older because she had extra time to develop that thick Spot, pattern. Yep. yep, that thick wow. pattern right there. That's Look, amazing. You can see it right there. That's amazing, guys. See it right there. See how there's no, there's yep. no armor, so there's, no shield? There's little shield. Oh yeah, there's definitely no shield here, guys. If you can feel that, look at that. Look at my thumb, right? And then look at my look thumb. Look at that here. right there. God damn, it's kind of harder. I'm not gonna hold you. I'm not doing that for the camera. Look, just look how, you can just see the neck oh, thickness yeah. right there. Look at that, that's, that's super thick. Look how thick that neck is right there. Yeah, that's a thick neck, or that's a turkey <laughs> neck. It's a iguana <laughs> neck. Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed the show and I hope you guys are enjoying the different transitions with the different seasons. Here in South Florida, huge shout out to the Iguana Ninja for coming out. <laughs> Lending a couple of hands, a couple of eyes, a couple of air rifle rounds on today's video. We got six of them real quick. Um, actually, if you guys want to see what's inside of these females, Ninja's, Ninja is pretty sure that there's eggs in there. I'm pretty sure there are too, but we're not quite sure on the development of what stages yeah. these eggs actually yeah, are. True. So on the next video, we're actually going to uh, be cleaning these iguanas and we're going to show you guys what stages. If any of them are with an edible size, we might be doing a catch, clean, and cook. So make sure you stay tuned to that video. Uh, Ninja, final thoughts on the day. Uh, guys, it was an epic day. That giant came out of nowhere. He just, he just hit the corner. We were talking to someone. He just appeared and he did not get the memo that Iguana Man, Iguana Ninja, was coming into town today. So... They got their matas combusted. We had a great one today. It was another banger. Guys, like, comment, subscribe. Let me put these bad there boys in my that's hand. That's for you, Ninja. That's for you, Ninja. Let's load up the Ninja. Hold on, there's more. There's more. There's more iguanas. Let's get it. More iguanas. Let's get it. Oh, oh, oh getting Let's a little get heavy there. Oh. There it is right there, Ninja. There it is. There. Oh. Just do, yep, do, your, do your iguana Ninja squats. One. Oh. Two. <laughs> oh, All right, that's enough working oh, out, Ninja. Oh, Put oh, those iguanas oh. in the bag, and we will see you guys on the next episode. Peace.